Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing okay. So today I thought you could keep me company whilst I try and style up my new chest of drawers because I am obsessed with these but I have been struggling a little bit to style them. Um, so I thought that today we could style them up together. Let me know what you think. But yeah, we are actually gonna be paneling this wall very, very soon. So this wall will be looking different and I'm sure that that will kind of change how things look as well. But for the time being, I wanted to do some filming in here today. So I thought that I would try and style this up properly because I've kind of just thrown stuff on here um, since it arrived a couple of weeks ago. So I wanted, like I said, to style it up properly. So. Yeah, let's <laughs> let's begin. I'm a little bit nervous because I always feel like I overthink things when it comes to styling. Um, I've been trying to get some inspo on Pinterest and then gather in some bits. And I also am going to be styling up some of the stuff that I bought from Home Bargains, which I showed in my recent Home Bargains haul. So I'll link that down below for you if you want to catch up on that. Oh, by the way, the I haven't said the chest of drawers are from Oak Furniture Land. Um, I think this is called the Newton range. I swear to God, these are literally my dream chest of drawers, which I know is very sad, but I've always wanted a wide chest of drawers unit. And I saw them over Christmas and they had like a big Christmas sale on, fell in love with them, ordered them New Year's Day. They weren't cheap. Um, I feel like they were quite a good price for real, a real wooden chest of drawers because wooden furniture is not cheap at all. Um, but I kind of saw them as a major investment piece and I know that I will love these till I am a little old lady. So I think I'm going to start up by putting a vase on. Um, I am going to take the pampas grass out because I've had uh, pampas grass in this vase. The vase is from Amazon by the way, it was an absolute bargain. Um, I'm not sure if it's still in stock, if it is I will definitely link it. Um, but I have had pampas grass in here for the past couple of years and I'm just a little bit bored of it um, and I did actually see Shay McGee say at the beginning of the year was at the end of I don't know anyways I saw her say a little while ago that she felt like pampas grass was out like it was a trend that's out so to be honest whatever she says gospel but um, no I'm just kidding I thought it'd be quite nice to add a little bit of color and greenery so we're going to take out the pampas grass and we're gonna add in some eucalyptus stems, which is what I bought from Home Bargains the other day. So I'm definitely glad that I went for the two bouquets because I feel like that has filled the vase really nicely. I still cannot believe the price of these. So these were 3 dollars per bouquet from Home Bargains. So let's add a photo frame. So I've seen a lot of people, I do feel like a landscape, would landscape work better? Um, I haven't actually got a landscape print to kind of hand at the moment, so this could be something that I add. I was thinking of maybe doing or getting like a nice coastal uh, picture, um, you know, because I do want in here to feel quite like coastally and calm. So for the time being, I've just got this wooden frame from Decenio and it is a picture of pampas grass. No, I said, oh, pampas grass is out. Um, Cause yeah, it's quite a nice natural frame and it'll do for the time being. In a bit of a quandary about what to do with the lamps, I'm gonna show you my two options. So we're either gonna go for one or two lamps. So you let me know, well, we're gonna have a look together and see what we think. So let's go for option one. So this again is Home Bargains Bargain. Um, I genuinely cannot believe the price of this lamp. It is such lovely quality. Um, it was 19.99, which I just thought was an absolute bargain. So I might have to change this the other side because this cable is not gonna reach down there. So this is, yeah, lamp option number one. These lamps from B&M, they were reduced from £12 to £6, so £12 for two lamps, these glass base. They came with like a neutral linen shade, but I found these blue scallop linen shades in Dunelm and I just really, really loved them. Um, I'm really liking blue at the moment. I think it's just a really pretty colour and it's nice and spring-like. Um, I had originally intended to use these for the bedside tables, but they just don't work. And to be honest, I'm just not sure 
on them as a lamp as a whole. So I wanted to try them on the chest of drawers. If they don't work on here, then I'm gonna take them back because I just don't think I can find a space for them. Um, but yeah, I was like, let's try them out and see. So yeah, so I was thinking about maybe, Um, kind of like look at it from different angles. I just think, I don't know if these are tall enough. I feel like if these were taller, then it could potentially look really cute with the blue to add a little bit of color into here. But I just don't know if they're enough of a statement, if that makes sense. To me, I just feel like that looks so much better. Um, yeah, I think that looks really cute. And I am pretty happy with that, to be fair. I feel like it's just nice and calming. So yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with that. I think that looks really nice. So I hope you've enjoyed this very kind of strange chaotic video of me trying to style up my chest of drawers um but i definitely want to do more of these kind of styling home decor videos because i love stuff like this um so yeah so let me know what you think do you think there's anything i need to add i am just i am still undecided about this i don't know whether we need to go landscape i don't know if maybe maybe we need to put something on the wall or to, you know wait until we've got the panel in um, if you've got something similar, let me know how you've styled it up. I would love to kind of hear any kind of tips or tricks. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. I think that looks nice. Um, so yeah, hope you're having a good day and I'll see you very soon. Bye.